Hey, beautiful Geminis. Welcome back, everyone. I hope you're doing amazing. Gemini, let's go straight to your energy. Someone may be leaving you on red. I don't know. The evil eye is here. Some kind of scheme here. Ponzi scheme. What's going on? Overindulgence. Too much, too fast. Okay, so somebody could be financially using you or there's financial abuse here. There is mental health issues here, Gemini. And you just can't sit with this. Someone is finally doing something about this. Somebody can't sit with this. What's going on? Ooh, some kind of uh, cult blocking someone's finances or there's a blockage someone is cruel and oppressive what is this some kind of strange behavior or cultish behavior somebody is too much too fast too soon somebody is blocking someone's finances because somebody is financially abusing money here there is financial abuse here. Either they're using you for your money or they're vice versa. Uh, or an organization is. I don't know. Someone is finally taking action. Somebody cannot sit with this. What's ever going on? Let's go to the tarot. What is this financial abuse? What's this financial abuse all about? Someone is an actual tyrant. There could be something hidden here or something sinister going on. What's going on? Some kind of Ponzi scheme that's going to crash. Okay, what is this? It's about money. Someone's like, you only live once. You only live once. Let's go spend all this money. <laughs> I don't know what this is. <laughs> Somebody is doing something about it. Someone's walking away. I can't sit with this. What is this, an, an organization that somebody is paying into? This could be a church or some kind of multi-level marketing scheme. I don't know what this is. This is financial usury or abuse. Someone's got their hand out. I don't know what's going on. There is some kind of financial manipulation here. Um, somebody may regret doing it or they're guilty. This could be friends. This could be a third party. What the hell is this all about? Well, we got an empress who can't deal with it. It's walking away. Somebody is trying to block somebody's finances or is using someone for their finances. These are financial blockages. What is going on? It's about investments. Somebody's over their head. This is some kind of I 
I don't know if friends are using somebody. This person is angry because like somebody's had enough they can't use you anymore or they can't use this empress anymore they got too big thought that it would never fail it's like overspending 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 what's going on there's so there's some kind of betrayal here someone's a thief This is some kind of multi-level marketing scam or scheme or a Ponzi scheme. You can't lose. You can't lose. You'll get a lot of money. It's like you give me, you give me $7,000. I pay you back $10,000. You give me four, you get seven. Something is like this going on. Some kind of financial abuse. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. With the, just a small investment. Uh oh. Somebody could be under investigation. Hmm. Somebody's getting too greedy here with money. It's for their own self gain, their own interest. They're hiding something, what they're doing for work. I don't know. There is some kind of... Oh, boy. This person's taking a gamble. Oh, shit. Somebody is using somebody for their money. And that's the bottom line. I don't know. Something's going to come financial crash here. Somebody. Big spender getting too selfish here. This could be accounts. This could be... Some kind of fraud. Con man. Somebody could be a con man. Being a fraud. Taking somebody's money. Using somebody for their money. Oh my, my. They're a con man. They're being betrayed. Oh, they're under stress. It's like, oh my God. I've invested in the wrong thing. Or this is a stock market crash. Or this is a company crashing. Or something like that. It's a scheme. This person's overspending, overspending, overspending. It's like...
money. This could be loans. Oh, what the heck? You only live once. Take out a bunch of loans. Take out... Uh, this is not good financially here. Somebody better watch their, their spending or watch their money or what they're investing in. This is like taking out loans and can't pay back the bank or uh, spending all their money on someone, a new fling or something saying, oh, you only live once. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All spend, 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 spend. They're being used for their money. Get your hands out of your pocket, whoever this is, and stop spending money. Uh, this isn't good. Money don't grow on trees. Someone thinks it does, but it don't. Somebody is too spend happy here. Foolish and reckless and irresponsible. I don't know. They could be praying for better days. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Oh boy. Someone's trying to avoid their karma. They cannot. This, somebody's lover is playing the emperor as a chump. It's about money. They're overwhelmed. Whatever they're doing, they're overspending. It's too much, too fast. Spending it too much, too fast. Ooh, they're going to be pissed straight off, man. I'm telling you. This could be seizing property. Seizing, a bank seizure, foreclosures, all kinds of stuff going on here. Somebody is really bad at managing their money or cannot keep their damn hands out of their pocket. Oh boy, on a new car, I want a new house, I want this new, I want that new, I want that. Somebody is just too materialistic and they are spending way too much money here. Get your hands out of your pocket. <laughs> I'm telling you. Giving everything away? This could be someone in their own family using them. I don't know. This person is getting used financially. They may have had, you know, opposites attract. 
but they're being used financially. This is financial abuse, financial usury. Some kind of karma. I'm saying tough love is necessary. Somebody, the tough love in this situation is financial abuse. Someone is going to have to stand up for themselves and use tough love because somebody, I don't know if these are adult children. I don't know if these are friends or lovers, but somebody is using somebody as a financial cash cow. And they are going to end up getting everything seized. We are talking about bankruptcy, liens, uh, overspending, borrowing money that they can't pay back, interest, high interest rates, stuff like that. Oh, you only live once, you know, get this attitude until they come seize everything. Somebody is like living like high on the hog here and they cannot afford to do it. They're watching everything dwindle away and going, oh, well, you know, you only live once. Yeah, that costs a lot of money. Oh, can I have this? Oh, can you buy me that? Oh, can you do this? Oh, can you do that? This person is going to end up bankrupt. I swear to God. And they're going to end up busted and alone. Following the crowd, trying to be sheeple, being a people pleaser. I don't know. They're getting involved with some swindler here. Someone is a con man. And somebody is finally doing something about it a scam it's a scam somebody else is sitting there celebrating you know what I mean this person is so naive so naive I it, it could involve identity theft fraud someone's a con man Someone in the family or somebody's friend is a con man. Hey, you know, they're a fast talker. They're a swindler. A swindler. Stop spending your money on them. If you are. If it's not you. It's somebody who you, you were hooked up to. Your past person. I don't know. They are being used for everything that they got. Someone is stealing someone's identity. They're into identity fraud. Watch out. They're a con man. They're gaslighting. They're going to get betrayed. I'm sorry. Someone has um, some kind of personality disorder. They're not happy unless they have all these material things. It's actually an addiction. It's a spending addiction. They can't stop spending money. 
I don't know if it could be gambling. I don't know if somebody's a swindler, a con man, conning someone out of, uh, out of their money. Uh, be careful of scams. I'm just saying. Don't be giving your credit card to nobody, your PIN numbers to nobody. Somebody is doing some bullshit here. Someone has the inability to see the bigger picture. Someone is financially using someone. It's too much, too soon. Overindulgence. <clears throat> and it says somebody has finally had enough somebody just can't sit with this it's like I can't do this anymore I can't do it anymore. Someone's a con man. They will sneak and steal behind your back as soon as your back is turned. Gemini, protect all your your finances. I'm just saying. Don't fall for scams. There's clickbait here. This person can't stop spending. It's like they're getting conned out of their money. They're being conned for money. Be careful, Gemini. Don't be giving people your money. Don't be giving people your personal identification. And whatever you do, don't fall for no stupid schemes and scams promising you get rich quick stuff it's a scam be careful <laughs> 